Hello, I would like to show you the way I do storyboard writing. <clears throat> and in the dawning multimedia age that we are rapidly entering, storyboard writing is uh, very useful to work with images and words at the same time when when writing a story. So as you see here, I'm using a piece of software called uh, Springboard and I searched and searched and tried a lot of different software. The reason I like Springboard, which I'm not advocating or advertising, I, I just think it's a good piece of software, is that it isn't bloated it does exactly what I need it to do and nothing else and I can run it on my netbook and on my home PC and it runs quickly and it doesn't give me any problems and as you can see it it's really basic you have images here and then as you go to each image you have the text down here and it does have, you can draw and create new panels within the program. These, these drawings here I did in Photoshop and imported them. And that's really easy to do. And also you, uh, so let's just say you want to write a story. You open up this program, you can, you can, from day one, you can start storyboarding in this program from scratch. You go up here, add new frame. You can say you have an idea for the first uh, five, you know, sequences. And you go in and on each frame, you go ahead and enter what you want to have happen. You know, um, I don't know. Uh, people run down the street. And you can just go through and rough in each scene that you want to happen. And then you can go back and start to draw in got a pen here and you know just real quick stuff you know just all it doesn't it, as long as you're clear about what you want the story to be about I find it helpful to start out with with very you know stick figure drawings that will make it so that I can get the basics of the story down real quickly without without um, slowing me down so in the initial state I can really start thinking about how I want to shape the story. Writing a story in, in storyboard form is a different type of writing than script or short story. It's very much it's very much like script writing or writing for film because you're you're thinking of the story in you know that's the way the story is taking place scene by scene shot by shot so that's the way it's conceptualized is as a visual story form on the other hand storyboarding is helpful for writing both for film and graphic novel and it, it's been my experience that those two styles of, of story writing are very different from each other and and I found it easier to write one way or the other and and uh, because for a while I was trying to write both for graphic novel and film and it got to a point where I was like okay I'm gonna write for film and then if I want to adapt it to graphic novel later good enough so as you see here it's a uh, very lightweight program, uh, 
easy to use and it um there are more capabilities um but at its most basic level you can start storyboarding today i hope that was helpful i make uh free tutorials to get the word out about my illustrated film at solimation.com so if you like my tutorials please take the time to visit my website and i hope you have great writing ahead good drawing ahead and a good day